All right, let's see what's going on here. Mm -mm. All right, all right. Happy Monday, everyone. Happy Monday. I'm just going to wait for a couple of people to join us. Then we're going to start here. Um, kind of a pop-up situation here with um, uh, one of our students, uh, Miguel. We'll have um, Miguel uh, talk about her experience at the Profit Room. <clears throat> Many of us know us. We're a stock market trading and education company. And what we do at the uh, Profit Room, we teach people how to build generational wealth based off of learning how to trade to find different financial markets. So that's what we do. Um, I post this on our page. I'm trying to post it uh, in our different uh, rooms as well, the Profit Trading Room and other rooms that we do have as well. So uh, I'm going to share now in public. I'm also going to share to our different groups, things of that nature. So um, we welcome uh, Miguel here. And we're just going to talk to her in a second. And make sure I get this as well in our profit trading room to our uh, group. Yep. All right. Cool, 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 cool. Please, guys, share it. And we're just going to have an open discussion about stock and options, things of that nature. So let me shut this off here. So, Miguel, welcome. Hi. Hi. Um, how you doing? You Good doing? evening. Happy Monday. All right. So can you tell tell everybody where you're from? Think just a little bit of background about yourself, because the only reason we do that, because uh, we have different students of different uh, diverse backgrounds, okay. uh, education, things of that nature. So it gives everybody a good synopsis of different people who learn how to trade or want to learn how to trade or invest. Okay. Um, I am a local chiropractor here in New Orleans, Louisiana. I've been in private practice going into about my 10th year. Um, I am married. I have two sons. I have one in college and one in high school. And um, mm -hmm. and actually just, just excited to actually have been able to take the side class. Okay, great, great. So... Uh, Miguel took our stock and options class. So once in a while, the profit room, we don't do it too often. We try to have a group course. And what that group course allows us to do to take four weekends and have people be able to learn together, uh, the stocks and the options. And at that time, throughout the week, they're able to digest the information. So our primary goal is to have private coaching with people. That's what we are known for, the one-on-one -on -one sessions. But we know everybody's situation can't allow that. And sometimes it's better to get a group of people together because they will motivate each other at that same time. We don't do it often, but we try to do it when we can. So Miguel was able to take advantage of this. And so first of all, uh, How did you hear about us? Why did you decide to take the course with us? Any other experience trading, investing, things right. like that? So I had, um, I would call just kind of um, amateur experience with stocks and with options. I had done stocks a while, a couple of years, just kind of on and off. And then I did, uh, recently I did a locally options class, which was very good as well. Um, but I, I felt like I just needed a little bit more. So I actually, honestly, I just kind of Googled and I did come across, um, I think I may have Googled, honestly, um, you know, black investors or something like that. And an article. Oh yeah. Them. We come up, uh, we come up number one Yeah, on I, I, Google yeah. for black day traders, black everything. Remember that we're not yeah. Facebook famous. Okay. And so honestly, that, you know, I, that's what I was looking for. And you did come up first. And then I went to YouTube and I watched a lot of the videos. I watched a lot of the videos first on YouTube. And, okay. um, and I had my husband watch them as well. And I just felt like, 
you know, you all, which came, came to be true, seemed very knowledgeable of it, um, years of experience. And so when I saw that it was the group class, then it was like a no brain. I think when I went on the website, I think it was like countdown. I think you had like a countdown for the class. So it was just a no brainer that I wanted to jump on board with it and just get started with it. So that's how I first found you all. Yeah. And that's, you know, what is funny because, you know, we post a lot in a lot of rooms, but we get majority of our people, you know, from like, you know, we got somebody today from Abu Dhabi, you know, all over, you know, yeah. and that's the, you know, that's the power of, you know, being amongst our people and doing what we can. Mm -hmm. So back to the course, how did you feel it was structured? What did you benefit from it? And things of that nature, like, uh, like you said, you've taken the course before locally, what did you may have find that might have been had a little bit di different or that you might have benefit from it from uh, other courses or something of that nature, you know, things of that nature? I, I found that class was very structured. So that's what I liked a lot about it. Um, mm -hmm. I felt like we were always on task. But I think the biggest thing was the four weeks, I mean, you all really broke it down step by step by step in each class. Um, if you or Latoya was speaking, then somebody else was answering questions, which I thought was like the tag team was phenomenal to me. I thought that was really helpful. Um, and then just being in the class, honestly, with other students and then, you know, kind of they're asking questions. You're like, oh, I didn't think about that. And you're asking questions. So I enjoyed the group setting a lot. Um, I still like I, like I was telling you before, like this is my, I think, fourth time watching the videos again. So the access to the Bundle of Wealth website to be able to go back over that information is vital. So it's mm -hmm. different to just be to sit in a class and then you walk away out of a class and then there's nothing else as as opposed to being in this class with you all i can walk away and still come back a week later and look over that information and just personally you know being a solar practitioner running the office i didn't really have a lot of time i look forward to my sunday class but during the week i really didn't i didn't feel like i had enough time to dive into it so using those going, being able to go back to the webinars and look at them over the weekend was just very, very helpful for me. But now, since we're in this stay at home, then I've really been able to dive in. That's why mm -hmm. I think I'm on my fourth time in the videos. So to me, everything timed perfectly because as soon as we finished the class, then you know we had to stay at home order. So it worked, worked great for me. I think if I wouldn't have had access to the classes, back you know to the um back to the webinars then i probably would be a little you know still kind of struggling a little bit just for me but that was vital for me correct so did you have any experience at all with like technicals like the charts and the candles because we yeah. find that a lot of people that throws them off sometimes with trading like it gets a little bit overwhelming i know you're um, yeah. a doctor, you know, all that stuff like that. But did that seem intimidating? Did you have any experience with that at all? Well, I did. I, I did. Mm -hmm. Being that I had the class, that helped me, honestly, um, mm -hmm. having that background with the charts. But you all, of course, you all have your own way of analyzing the charts. So seeing the charts, but you all, I, I still felt like the class made it simple. I think you all broke it down to, um, to a simpler way to look at it. But for me personally, having a little bit of the background did, did help. Um, but I think the, the biggest thing, honestly, Ernest, though, still for me, even with the background, is going back and watching the videos. Yep. Like, I still okay. feel like, you know, even the third time, I may go back and I say, all right, so he means this and this. All right, when I'm looking at the move averages, is this. So just just still being able to go back and, and take my time with it is still, still was very, very beneficial for me. Gotcha. So uh, once again, this is Miguel. She's the, a group, we, um, once in a while, we try to do a group stock and options course because our whole goal is for people to have 
the one-on-one -on -one mentorship because everybody can learn a little bit different. It's more personalized approach. So we put together a group uh, a course for the stock and options and as well, you have the replays and some people can pick up much, much faster that way, especially have support. But on top of that, um, this go round, um, she's in our private channel to give support. And one thing like she mentions, and what I know, when you learn something the first time, you just don't get it. Like sitting down like for an hour, it's like you get analysis paralysis and you walk away. So we thought about that this time around with a lot more. And now you have this private group. So tell them a little bit about how the private group has helped you and what are you benefiting from that or adjusting uh, things of that nature? So the private group is, um, I found it gave a lot of more in depth as far as with the fundamentals. So, you know, um, the Greeks and all right, when I'm looking at, when I'm looking at an options chart, then this is saying this. So that, that gave more of a background, more in-depth information. And I guess it just depends on your learning style. For me, then, yeah, that helped to simplify things for me too and look at it and say, all right, I never thought about, thought about it this way. You know, sometimes, a lot of times in a, I have my, um, in that chat, I have like a pad and pen too to kind of write down, all right, this is what that means. So it goes, that was helpful too. I appreciated it because how I learn, I, um, I, for me, I have to dig a little deeper. So I need to know, okay, so what does the moving average mean? And so what is the formula for the moving average? It may mean nothing to anyone else, but for me, that's how I learned. So I found the chat gave me that. Yeah. You see what uh, uh, Miguel is talking about. So Latoya and I, we focus a lot on technicals. We try to bring that visual aspect. And even with our options course, a lot of people don't touch base on it. We do talk about Delta. We talk about, you know, the different Greeks and things of that nature, just to give you an idea of what's actually going on, right? And we go into detail, we try. But now we have a secret weapon that we have for years, and his name is Don. And Don, once you get in that room, tell tell him a little bit about Don. Oh. I want to tell him about Don. <laughs> Don is phenomenal. I mean, he is like the um, stock guru. I mean, if you ask a question, I mean, it's like he's like an encyclopedia. So anything you want to know, he knows the answer in length. And, you know, he, if you don't understand it, he, he always ends it with, if you don't, if you don't understand it, let me know, let me know what you're not getting. And you all did that too. I want to say that in the class too, that I, I did appreciate because even, um, you know, if someone asked the same questions, you all were very patient and um, you, we really didn't move on until you knew we had it. So that, that was much appreciated And the same thing in the class with Don. Correct. Yeah. And I think that's good because like we was talking about before, everybody knows their lane. You know, I primarily focus a lot on technicals. I really get that. And we know our strength and our weaknesses a lot. And that's the same thing with Don. Don is a options guru. <laughs> I mean, like yes. the numbers, like to the T, he <laughs> can break down the, the Greeks yeah. and like crazy. Yeah. But he relies on us for technicals. Yeah. You know, and the thing is, that's where our whole goal is for people to be able to like, okay, and that's why we hand feed everybody. So like a lot of message, I'll get a lot of messages. Hey, I know we went over week one. I kind of knew that stuff already. Are we going to learn about this, this, this? And I'll just say, listen, don't worry about it. Mm -hmm. You're going to get it. Don't mm -hmm. worry about it. You're going to get it because you can't take all of that stuff at once you yeah. can't take it you gotta let it digest yeah. you gotta like so imagine if we brought don on yeah. <laughs> doing a live y'all would have been like hold up what's this question yeah. what's that question he's like nope we're gonna we're gonna bring everybody in the group and allow don to do his thing yeah. because 
it'd be like Sunday morning. <laughs> it'd be like Saturday. And I'm like, what are y'all talking about in there? And y'all having these big book conversations <laughs> yes. about options Sunday morning. Uh-huh. I'm like, Don, but that's what we wanted to bring for yeah. people to understand. So since you're new, tell us a little bit about your journey, what, you, what you've been doing now, what you plan on doing, because, you know, uh, you finished the course probably, I don't know, maybe um, about a month ago yeah. or so. At the end of March, had, I think. Mm-hmm. The end of March. And just for everybody to be like realistic, because we always say okay. that's why we have a lot of uh, private students, okay. because even in this condition, you know, you being a professional, you know, it takes time to master. So whatever struggles you're having now, you can express that, how you're going into trading, things of that nature. Okay. Um, I think the biggest takeaway for anybody is just what you said. It takes time and you have to put in the time. I think this, like today I woke up and I just kind of went and looked at just trying to see what the market is doing. Like for me, I have to wake up. I got my coffee. I have to like just chill a little bit, relax. Don't get too antsy. Don't get too emotional. Don't want, don't, you know, cause you, sometimes you can feel like, well, I just want to play. I just want to get in a play to your demise. And that could be to your demise. So um, like today I just did a lot of studying and, and I found myself studying honestly for like three or four hours and you can, and I still feel like I have more to do. And so, but for me, I want to make sure like I know what I know. So um, my journey, when I initially started um, in a class locally, I was paper trading. And so Mm -hmm. when I started the class with you all, um, I didn't, I didn't do any trades because I wanted to wait like you all suggested before doing any trades. And so now I do trade live. I, I just do very small plays. Um, I only funded my account with $500 for me, even losing $20, I'm upset about losing $20. So for me, I knew that I needed to come up with a system. And so like one day was great for me. And then the next day I was just on a high and I'm like, yeah, I want to play and just jumped in and didn't even stick to any of my rules. And then I was upset and I beat myself up about it and I dreamt about it and I was mad about it. So like, for, I know, you know, for myself what I need to do. So now I'm just doing small plays. I have a journal. I just write down my rules, you know, you know, to look at this, you know, to do this, you know, you know, to kind of calculate and calculate um, what I'm anticipating my profit to be and just trying to stay on top of stop top on it um stay on top of it that way but it is it is a journey you know if you think you're going to get in and make five thousand dollars one day that's just to me unrealistic i mean as a newbie um it 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 takes time and it takes it is an investment and so you invest in yourself it is an investment it's education you know like i really felt like that i felt like the profit room educated me and so i felt like in a sense i was in school and so, and that's how I looked at it. I'm in school and I'm learning, I'm investing in myself um, to pass on to my kids. And so, but it takes time as with anything. So I, I think you have to have that mindset and, and emotions. When you talk about emotions, 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 um, and you hear that a lot, the emotions of the market and your emotions. And so again, like in my example, I did well one day and I just was felt like I, I needed to get in and, um, on those emotional highs. So you, I think for everybody, you just have to kind of find out what, know yourself, know what works for you. But again, know that it, it is going to take, it's going to take time and it's going to take work. Yeah. And I, I think you made a great point where, like you said, funding that count with that amount of money of like $500 is a great start because if you got, out of control with emotions yeah. and you had so much more money in there, I know. you'd be beating yourself up even yeah. more. So like I always say $20 is still a lot. $20, 20,000. You have to yeah. treat it the same way. You're yeah. not going to drive down the street. If you drive down the street and a dollar flies out your window, yeah. we're going to pull over <laughs> right. and tell the cars to stop. That's my dollar in the street. 
Yeah. But that's when we come to trading and investing, we don't keep that same mindset. Yeah. But because you're going to have see that, and that's the thing we talked about before. You're going to have losers. Yeah. You're going to have winners. Yeah. But you need controlled losses. Yeah. And the fact is, like you're saying, what you're doing is great because you know how to make the money back. Like you're going to get that mindset. Like okay, that's where like like a lot of our new students or stuff like that, they say, hey, when should I get out? I say, listen, you see green, take yeah. it. Yeah. Right at this point, you yeah. see green, take it. Yeah. Because I need, you need that confidence. Because yeah. you see how much you beat up on yourself. Yeah. So once you get to that stage, okay, I'm gonna let it run longer. Or I need to run. Like I'll get students like, hey, I don't want to get out yet. I could have made this. Yeah, you could have made this, but nobody yeah. think about what you could have lost. Exactly. Like that. So, yeah. and it's time. Yeah. Because I tell people all the time, there's times where people don't realize when me and Latoya started trading, one day can wipe out a whole month of profits. Yeah. And you sit back and you're yeah. like, I done got up every day, yep. seven in the morning and traded every day. Yeah. And this one day just... I wasted my time. Yeah. I wasted my time. Yeah. But you're in that stage now where it's like, okay, let me control how my emotions get the plan yeah. and keep it moving. And I think that's what helps you on your mindset because it's realistic. Yeah. It is very realistic. And yeah. that's why like we get a lot of new students now and they say, Hey, how fast can I learn how to make money? I said, it depends. And I say, you got to give yourself at least three months yeah. or something of that nature. And the fact, like you're, you're telling people now you're studying every day, yeah. you know, you're in a group of people in a room every day that's talking about trading yeah. and you still got your little demons to fight. Yeah. So, so yeah. it's that's realistic. True. And, and, and like I said, it's so different from the paper trading because once you, once you get in with that real money, it's like, you know, you feel it. It's, it's just a yeah. feeling, you know, it's just different. And so knowing that, and even when I lost, I'm like, okay, I, I felt uncontrolled. So knowing that um, it, it, it's important. It, and again, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do it any other way, but start for me personally, starting off small, because again, just a little 20 hours, I was sick over that. So I couldn't, I, I don't want to imagine I want to lose, if I lose, I want to lose knowing I thought I did everything right versus I didn't do any of the stuff right that I had written down. So, um, but again, for me, um, the videos, the videos, the videos and the studying was, is just vital for me. No, that's good. No, that's great. Mm -hmm. And that's what, that's what we always advocate is the education side of yeah. it, because the way you're sounding, you are a thorough learner. Yeah, you're the third. You're a thorough learner, and in this, we always say control the emotion yeah. and follow the plan. Yeah. And once you are part of a group of people, right? Like I always tell our students, if we can't explain it to you, yeah, don't believe us. And yeah. that's our whole goal. So when you see the videos, right, and you are taught, are you able to see the same concepts on your own? Oh yeah. In that chart. Oh yeah, okay. definitely. Even, That's our goal. Oh yeah, definitely. Even like I said, the day I was beating myself up, and the next day, you know, I'm watching the videos with my mouth poked out, like, oh. And it happened to be one of the videos, and you were saying, you know, um, you're gonna win. Basically, like you're gonna win some, you're gonna lose some. You're gonna, you know, it's gonna be ups and gonna, it's gonna be downs. And you know, if you're funding it, and it was like, all right, all right, that motivated me again. Like, all right, okay, okay, Miguel, you're not gonna win all the time, and you know, you you won't get it right all the time. But if you stick to your principles, then you'll feel a little bit better about it. So yeah, the, the they they it did all that for me. It did, yeah, the videos were just right on. Now that's cool. So, I mean, that's our whole goal for you to understand and be able, like you said, you have children, you have a business, you have a lot of stuff to take care of and mm -hmm. to be able to pass this on and be able to teach and things of that nature. That that was our whole goal yeah. of putting, well, even all our students like that, because we attract a certain type of customer because we turn down people a lot. 
we get a lot of people who call and they ask, okay, when can I flip this? Or how fast can I do this? Or something like that. And they're like, no, I'm sorry. It's not for us. It's not for us. Because as you, you see, that group, like this group has been very great because like what did Latoya said, the last thing on that last Sunday, use that group. You got to use it. You got, <laughs> even if you don't ask questions, you have to use that group oh, yeah. in order to get your questions answered yeah. and all of your stuff right there. And that's how you benefit. And that's one of the reasons why a lot of traders may not make it over that hump because yeah. of being shy or not really putting out or not really like everybody doesn't have to be outspoken. I'm very outspoken more than Latoya in that sense, but you have to be able to log in and do what you're doing. Yeah. Rinse and repeat, rinse and yeah. repeat, rinse and repeat. Cause every time you see it, you're going to see something different and that makes True. it um, even better. True. Yeah. So we thank you for um, helping us with the interview. Thank things you. of that nature. Um, we have a lot of other students that are going to uh, interview as well. We don't do it that often. That's why, and we always do uh, student success with our private one-on-one -on -one students. Mm -hmm. But we know once in a while we try to do the group thing and see how that has benefit because everybody benefits different. Yeah. And we appreciate you know you uh, telling everybody how you feel about the profit room and um, much success to you. Thanks. We'll see you uh, also back in the room. Yes. And be safe down there in New right. Orleans. Same you know, you're you hot with me in New Jersey. Yeah. So yeah. be very, very safe. So we Thank appreciate you. it. Much success to you. Thank you. Much Thank success you to you. And, and as always, get educated, trade safe. Yeah. You have a great night. All right. Thank you. Thank All you. right. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye.